All right, what's good, YouTube? It's your homeboy, Cam Quarter Banks. Welcome to my channel, Cooler with Cam Quarter, where you get content focused on streetwear, sneaker content, and menswear fashion. Now, if this is your first time tuning in to my channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, hit that like button, and drop a comment down below and let me know you rocking with the tank. Now, I know y'all see that description down below, man, so let's just get right into it. Y'all know how we do it. Roll camera. All right, now, first thing first, man, a lot of people been asking me, yo, how do you win on sneakers app, man? It's like different to get anything on sneaker app I wanted to just lay out some quick tips for y'all on like how to get a bigger possibility on winning some sneakers on the sneaker app now we already know that we are up against millions of people when it's some official sneakers like some limited sneakers you are up against millions of people who want the same thing as you and then on top of that you got a number of people that already got bought so we not only up against millions of people we up against resellers winning on the sneaker apps is basically like throwing a Hail Mary up in the air man and wishing for the best at this point so let's just jump right into it all right step number one all them apps that you got open on your phone man block those out the sneaker app goes off data so you're already opening so many apps man you using too much data and that's slowing your phone down don't slow your phone down because you need to process and get in line before you even buy those sneakers so while it's doing that spin wheel and your data is moving real slow guess what you are not gonna get a chance to win those sneakers just like everybody else trying to win stop slowing your phone down cut all them apps out like go in your phone open like you know if you got an iPhone I don't know how Android people do it I got an iPhone so swipe up from the bottom and see how many apps you got open and knock them all out close them out completely that's all you need now number two you you need to be in a Wi-Fi area have some strong Wi-Fi what is one either have some strong service on your phone so wherever you at make sure you have some strong service on your phone or if you are in a nice place like if you are in a good spot like Starbucks or something like that like uh, a coffee shop or whatever it may be wherever you use your laptop even if you're in a library make sure that it has some strong Wi-Fi service because again if your phone is moving slow you're definitely gonna have a hard time when you're trying to catch out on the app you so make sure you either have some good service or you actually have some good Wi-Fi now number three with before a sneaker app uh, before a sneaker drops you should be dropped you should be already in the app you should be in the app like 10 minutes before the sneaker even drop reasons why I say 10 minutes before because you want to run through everything and make sure you're doing the right thing as far as are your settings all straight like I got the right size shoe I want the right sneaker this is how much it costs I know I have this much cash where you could check inside of the bank give yourself about 10 minutes ahead of time to be inside of the sneaker app and know everything that is gonna be correct because everything that you do in this sneaker apps needs to be like one two three it needs to be completely fast when you jump in this app and buy this shoe so give yourself about 10 minutes to get up in that sneaker before the app actually drops the sneaker and usually the sneakers really drop around around 10 o'clock Eastern Standard Time 9 o'clock Central Standard Time 7 a.m. Pacific Standard Time so make sure that you are in it out like I said 10 minutes ahead of time before the sneaker actually drops it'll tell you right off the bat it'll tell you when it's dropping so make sure you're in that 10 minutes before now number four it tell like I said that's kind of going off the, off of what I just said it already tells you ahead of time when the sneaker is dropping so you should be up in that app maybe a few days before to give yourself a reminder it says notify me now when you click that notify me button all you have to do is just look in your phone and it will remind you that day when it's about to drop it should remind you the day before and it should remind you like uh like like almost an hour or two before the sneaker actually drops it's gonna send it to your phone since you click that notify me so that gives you time to actually be up in your phone and get all your settings together so make sure you hit that notify button that will be a way to remind you that this sneaker is dropping because sometimes people do actually forget when the sneaker is dropping and they let it slip their mind and before they know it everybody's talking about the sneaker and now they're looking in the app like damn I just missed this sneaker I forgot about it now number five is the biggest thing of all in your sneaker app man you should be having all your settings set up in your wallet I don't know how it is for Android users but like you got your Apple wallet you got your Google wallet and all that make sure you have that set up and make sure that it's connected with your sneaker app if you have that 
set up with your sneaker app and you have everything that's inside of your settings on the sneaker app all good to go i mean like have your address have your shoe size all set have everything that you need is set like your name your address make sure that you have your shoe size and at the same time make sure that that wallet is connected to the sneakers app so you're not wasting time when you open up the app like when you open up the app and a sneaker drops you're not wasting your time trying to put that information in like oh i live here and this is my name and this is the size i wear that's taking up time because everybody else is clicking that buy button while you're still trying to add in all this information and you just lost your chance because sneakers really like if it's a really exclusive sneaker the sneakers are going to burn out within the first five ten minutes easily bro and i i've even tried it and it's blown me so you need to make sure everything is connected to your iphone or android make sure that your google wallet or apple wallet or apple pay whatever is connected to whatever you have to use that like make sure that your your credit card information is connected to the sneakers app make sure that you have that information already set so when it does drop by the time you do uh like by the time you try to buy your sneaker like i said if you're entering the app 10 minutes before and you're already set and you make sure everything is all good to go by the time the sneaker drop all you have to do is bip bam and you done that being said man that's the five things that you really need to get a bigger chance of winning in the sneakers app man i hope that gave y'all some info to some more detail and i hope y'all win man hey i i i be hitting the big sometimes too so hopefully y'all get a bigger chance at winning the sneaker that y'all want all right now with all that being said i'm about to get up out of here i gotta try to get me some sneakers first thing in a couple actually in a couple minutes man this sneaker is about to drop this pine sneaker is about to drop jordan ones you feel me so i'm about to get up out of here man i'll catch up with y'all in a minute i'm out i'm gone i holla at you y'all already know how i go peace Enlightened creature here Ain't no man that I'ma fear Godly and I hardly fuck with peasants Going 